Hello YouTube, the Evil Sketch here with another tutorial. Uh, this time it's a tutorial on a request actually. I got a request for a Nordic Warrior thing. And when I thought Nordic Warrior, I thought something in the lines of something like this guy. Um, obviously different kinds of weaponry, but something like this guy. And um, with the shoulder pads and which gives him that, that bulky look at his back and uh, I guess also bearded and then maybe something with horns something like that so um, it's certainly gonna draw on previous tutorials but it's always nice to get another one just for some of the more recent um, recent subscribers to this channel which have been going quite well I will thank all of you if you're watching right now I would really like to thank you for subscribing to this channel also if you checked out my planet minecraft account that's been going extremely extremely well as well I got almost 10,000 views in in a few few days on uh, on statues videos St I uploaded a project on uh, Planet Minecraft of the statues, and um, and uh, they got a lot of attention in a very short time, and uh, I was extremely glad to see that. So that was that was very nice. I'm just so glad about. It. Also, I did this. Uh, there's a guy who asked me on Planet Minecraft how I could help him with sort of a icy wizard, I guess enchantress, female wizard thingy. So uh, this is what I came up with. I don't know if it's. Hmm. You know what? I kind of like it. I, I kind of like this. Could be a little bit taller though. I just. Maybe just like that. And. This. Maybe some more skin. No, that doesn't work. That definitely doesn't work. Oh, no, no, no. There we go. And. Yeah, that looks weird too. Um. Oh, maybe something like that. Yeah. Um, but yeah, let's let's start off. We got our usual with some bricks. And mm, let's see. Another brick. There we go. And obviously a... This, by the way, is the texture pack that I'm cu currently working on. I'm not so totally happy about the stone bricks, but it will do for the time being. Oh damn it! I switched out there. Oh damn it! Why didn't you say so? There we go. So let's start off with the usual placement of feet. I like to put one foot in front of the other, and remember the first one has to block there. Oh, we need some sandstone. So oh damn it! Ah oh, damn it! Okay, and then a full sandstone block right there, and a sandstone block there, and pop, 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 like that. Full block, stair, stair, and upside down stair. And here we have stair, and then we have upside down stone bricks there, and full block. And just carry it all the way up. There we go. There we have the placement of the feet. Now we'll just place the, I guess, the, the skirt. So, let's do what I usually do. This is what I find to create the best result. There we go. And something like, oops. I considered maybe making a battle position or something, a more aggressive, offensive position. Not, not like that, and not like that, but something something different with the arms. So, um, there's going to be a bit of experimenting <coughs> with this uh, statue. So, a chief shape with stone bricks, and uh, just cross the lines there, and one block there. And you're done with the full blocks. No more stair, upside down stair, upside down stair, no more block. And then I put a stand here. And uh, these can be changed so much according to. Again, preference. 
and got this shape. Very nice, very nice. We can even have, let's see, we need some slaps. Yep. You know what? No. We need some slaps. Uh, let's see. Yep, there we go. Slab. Oh, no, stairs. Uh, there we go. <coughs> and upside down stair. Upside down stair. And upside down stair. Yep. And then slaps on each side right there. Just for now. Just for now. And then sandstone there for the neck. And then we have a full block for the head. You know what? Just to indicate the beard, I'm just going to do that. Okay. Uh, let's see. Before doing the arms, I will do the head. Just so we have that in order. So, stairs, stairs on each side. Brick stairs, of course. And then, you know what? I'm just going to do this. And, oops. Oh, what should I do? Yeah, let's do that. I don't know if this works. This looks kind of weird, doesn't it? Maybe something like that. <laughs> that oh, okay, we definitely need to fill this out. I don't know if that's the way to go. Then a full block there. You know, we can actually change those as well. So we have that, and then this can go down to become something like. You know, just just try with the, with beards and stuff like that. Just put some random stuff in there, and it's, it's I guess it's gonna work. And then I'll just take shoulder pads, just and shoulders right there and there. <sighs> yeah, the horns sort of weird. I wanna create some type of horn, but that just makes the hat looks freaking freaking stupid. Like that no, mm, maybe a slap, a slap, something like no. That just okay. Let's see. Hey, slap. Mm, nope. Definitely not. I don't like that. Maybe it doesn't need a hat. Maybe just eat. Not then it becomes like the other one. We don't want that. I want something more like. <laughs> I could do something more like the Dwarven hat. That certainly has some elements. You know what? I'm just going to do this. And uh, I don't care. Maybe we could use fence. It was kind of weird, but you know what? It could work. I'm just going to do this for now. And do that. Yeah. It's a dragon. <laughs> I don't know. Sounds like. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Looks like he has a cap on with horns and a thingy. On the far oh, I could do something else. I could use a frame actually. And then then a color or something. That'd be kinda cool. I just something like that. Yeah, let's do that. That looks kinda cool. <clears throat> that way you could actually make a face for that. We're not going to do that. Okay, so, um, I think that looks stupid, actually. There we go. Now, the arms. Um, the arms are going to be more like, I don't know, actually. Hmm. We want them sort of holding. I want to give this guy a two-handed arm weapon or something. That would be freaking awesome. Um, I haven't really done that. This is what I usually do and then I give him wristbands like that. But I don't know. I'm just going to check something over here. Um, other news, I've become a YouTube partner, which is kind of weird. It happened very 
very fast. It was just one day to the other, and I became a YouTube partner. I know being a partner uh, now is not as special as it was back then, but it's still kind of nice because now I can upload videos longer than 15 minutes. So I don't have to cut as much. I can do the let's. I can make the let's builds longer actually, or I could make them shorter, just 10 minutes. Maybe we'll do that. Let's see. Uh, maybe we want something like that. Maybe more something like that. And he's sort of holding the weapon that way, sort of sideways. I kind of, I kind of want that. Maybe we should be holding it like this guy's holding the flag. I could. Okay. You know what? Let's try that. Let's see what did I do over here. I did. I'll just set the time. I did. This okay. Yep, that's weird. That looks all right. Hmm. That works better. And um, let's see. It goes down there, and that looks sort of weird. If I did, you know what? That's why I look weird. Maybe we should have. <sighs> Okay, I think I got it. We could try something along those lines. Because uh, most of them are very static. Uh, I would like to make them more dynamic, like this guy over here. So now I could I could make some this guy more dynamic, I guess. Maybe if I had his hand thrusted forward or something. Looking very aggressive. Um, something more like... Maybe something more like or maybe throwing his hand up in the air so that hmm. sort of waving his fist at people. Yeah, we could do that. That'd be kind of fun. Then the shoulder pad would sort of fall down there. Maybe it would stay on, actually. And this would become more like like that, I guess. No. That looks very weird. Mm. I don't know. You know what? So this is the experimenting part, <laughs> if you hadn't guessed already. So uh, that arm becomes very long. So maybe if I cut it down to maybe there, then it works. And if I just put in, then his arm becomes very saggy. If I use a slab instead, would that help at all? Oh, that could help maybe a bit. Nope. <laughs> well, <Blah. laughs> uh. let's see. Um. Oh, damn it. I feel good. He's definitely stronger. No. Oh, this doesn't work. Maybe we should just try the, the two-handed deal. The two-handed deal. <laughs> the two-handed deal. Mm, nope. this what do we have over here we have these guys we have yeah, that's pretty much what we have over here uh, 
I want to have his arms more really. Hmm, let's see. This guy over here, he's certainly running. That's because of this type of stuff. And these guys are fighting. And if this guy's sword is going to be in any way threatening. A Nordic or You know what? We'll just do. A freaking brute. With no weapon in his hand, actually. I'll just do something like... Like this. Oh, he has... actually has his arm. And his beard sort of goes outside and maybe don't know. <laughs> Something like that, I guess. Has his arm there. And uh you know what? Maybe he has his sword. Hume's done. I'm gonna give him a sword, just for the fun of it. Just because, why not? And uh, let's see. We'll need some wool. That's actually all we're gonna need. And I could just have grabbed it from over there, but we don't. We're not gonna sell anyone. <laughs> So this is actually a Nordic warrior. I kind of like this guy actually. Oops, that's not right. That was better. Maybe if his arm were more thrusted outward, it would look a bit better. Hmm. So this is highly designed and highly experimenting. So I do apologize if you feel it's going slow. I'm not really sure. You know what? We're just gonna give him a shield. That's that's only a long time ago. And they had wooden shields. At least Vikings did that. Wooden shields. So we're gonna portray wood with brick, because <laughs> that makes sense. And uh, that's where. Boop, boop. That's the core. And this is what I will be using. Oops. They were fairly big, so I think this is very... I could make it... You know what? Oh, damn it. I'm just... For fun of it. For the fun of it. I'm just going to make it out of... Uh, stone bricks. Oh, let's see. Yeah. You know what? That I, that is actually kind of cool. I kind of I kind of really like that. Oh, is the shield too small? I almost feel like the shield is too small. No, no, no. I actually really like this. This is uh, it could certainly be on his back or something. I think it's because his his sword is so close to his body. If I were just to look. There, it's over there, and that sort of works better. I'm just gonna look at some of the old. You know what? I'm gonna do like that guy. Oh, that guy looks great too. Oh, let's see. I really apologize for not uploading uh, some more videos. I'm gonna continue the last build. I just need to finish the, the world painter map, and it takes forever to do because I kind of have to redo it. And, uh,. It's very tedious work, actually. I, I almost did all of it, and then I had to redo it because I fucked it up with the water flowing tool in um in World Painter, and it just freaking destroyed everything. And it's so annoying, and I'm so sad. And ah, uh, freaking sucks. But that is not too, you know, 
Check it. Oh, that's how I did it. So like that. Yep. And then of course. You know what? I'm gonna do an X. That does not look like an X. <laughs> oh, I thought I was gonna do an X, but I'm gonna do a hammer instead. I could make him a breed, bro <laughs> breed, a brood. You know what? That actually like kind of looks cool. Or I could make it face the other way, sort of turn around. I am Thor! Taste my lightning! No. Um. <laughs> we could do something like that, hammer maybe. You know what, I actually like it. I think it's, it looks cool. I like it this way. I'm gonna keep it this way. We're gonna cover him in blood. We're gonna get some blood in the form of red wool. Blood. Ugh. Ugh. I'm hit. No. So, uh, oh. Yep. That is actually it. So, uh, I really hope you enjoyed this video. And, uh, thanks so much for watching.